Binoculars can be a great addition to any holiday or a day trip out, but some of the technical jargon that surrounds them can easily leave us confused. So to help us get to grips with the different features of binoculars, I'm joined by which binoculars expert, Kate Ship. Hello Kate. Hiya John. So what should people first consider when they're looking into buying a new pair of binoculars? Well the first thing to think about is how and when you plan to use your binoculars. Binoculars tend to be split between two different types, compact models and standard size models, so it's important you choose the right pair for you. So what are the key differences? Compact models are smaller than standard size models, so they're great for a city break or a day trip out. They can easily pack into your hand luggage or fit into a coat pocket. Standard size models are larger in size and tend to be heavier in weight. One visible difference between compact and standard size models is the size of the objective lens. This is the lens at the end of the binoculars where light enters. So why might you want standard size binoculars? Standard size models have a larger objective lens diameter. This means that more light will enter the binoculars. If all other factors are equal, then this should produce a brighter image in low light conditions. Compact models have a smaller objective lens diameter. This means they tend to perform best in brighter daylight conditions. And how can I find out what the objective lens diameter is? The objective lens diameter is recorded in millimetres. It's usually written as the second number on the body of the binoculars. In this case, it's 25 millimetres. And is there anything else that I should be looking for? The other key specification is a binoculars magnification. This is often written as the first number on the binoculars body. In this case, the magnification is eight times. This means that the image will appear eight times larger than that seen with the naked eye. So what's the best way to focus my binoculars? It's really easy to focus your binoculars in just five simple steps. First look through your binoculars at a plain scene, such as sky or grass, and move the central hinge until you see a single bright circle. Cover the barrel with the diopter adjustment on its eyepiece, which is usually on the right hand side. The diopter adjustment compensates for the difference in the strength of your eyes. Look at a fixed object in the distance and use the central focusing wheel to focus the binoculars until the image appears clear and sharp. While looking at the same image, cover the left barrel. Move the diopter adjustment on the right eyepiece to make the image appear clear and sharp. You are now ready to start using your binoculars. Unless someone else uses the same pair, you will only need to use the central focusing wheel to refocus. Thanks Kate, that's really useful. For more information on binoculars, including Best Buy reviews, visit witch.co.uk forward slash binoculars.